Hey everybody, it's me, Alexandra, with another Shades EQ video. Today we'll be testing out 39 Redken Shades EQ Liquid Toner products. Um, some of these I did do in other videos, so you will see some repeats and some new shades. Enjoy! So I have a lot of like little pieces of extensions that I have just accumulated over time. Um, maybe my clients haven't used them all or like we have like a little bit left so I'll just save them for videos like this. So I'm going to match as well as I possibly can with what I have. All right, and I will be mixing the toners with the Redken Shades EQ Processing Solution. When I'm in the salon, I typically use the Wella Color Touch Volume 6 only because I like a creamier consistency. So I have done quite a few of these videos and I think I found an easy way for me to do this. What I'm gonna do is do levels nine and 10 first, let them process for about 15 to 20 minutes, which is recommended. And then as soon as they're all done processing, I'm gonna rinse them all off and then leave them to the side. And then I'm gonna do the next level and then the level after that. The reason being is because I want them all to process accordingly. And if I do them all at once, some will sit on longer than others like I have done in previous videos. So I'm learning from what I've done in the past and I believe this is the best way possible to demonstrate what I am doing today. I don't know if you guys have ever seen the Shades EQ bottles where it says uh, Bonder inside. I wasn't sure what that meant, so I just looked it up and I was going to share. It says a Shades EQ Bonder inside is an all-in-one acidic demi permanent toner plus bonder that tones and helps protect the strength of sensitized hair in step one, delivering incredible shine and condition with true to tone results. Um, it does say that the bonder inside may look a little darker mixed with processing solution than the normal Shades EQ gloss. So I thought that was very interesting.
Guys, I'm not gonna lie, I'm just letting you know now that these results, the levels three to five, they really don't look any different, barely any pigment. I am sure it's because these are extensions. Um, this wouldn't normally happen with like normal hair, but I'm telling you in the results, I barely see any change. Just letting you guys know, I did leave it in the video just to show you what the results were, but there's little to no change. Hey everybody, it's me editing right now. I just wanted to throw in there that if you're not already subscribed, please subscribe, it will help me out. I can't believe I'm already at almost like 4,000 subscribers and I started my YouTube channel back in 2018, 2019. I remember only having like 40 subscribers so the fact that I'm almost at like 4,000 is just so crazy. Thank you so much. I love using my platform to help other stylists. Um, I have so much fun making these videos. So if you like this video, make sure that you give it a thumbs up. Um, if this helped you, make sure that you share it with a fellow stylist, maybe it will help them out. And comment down below what your favorite toner is. Right now, I am leaning towards like the Violet Golds. I think they're just perfect to add to any like blonde formula. 
Um, so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, let's get to the results.